hello and welcome to the channel once again the name is guru boy so in this video or in this tutorial i'm going to show you how you can remove google account verification or be stuck on the wi-fi without any skip button on your technos pack 9 or any technos model technos pack 9 model so in this tutorial you have to connect to a wi-fi to have internet connection you need, you need to have internet connection to set up our device so in here make sure to provide a password if you are wi-fi you do have password on it so when you do proceed to set up your device you will be prompt to provide your previous pin which was being set on the device that got you to reset your device and at some point you also forgot your google account id so in this video i'm going to show you all the basic steps you need to remove the google account or the frp being locked on your spark 9 device so in here this device is run on android 12 and this method will work on your techno device running on android 12 so without wasting much time let's move back to the wi-fi menu and start the procedure by clicking on the qr code click on nearby and then turn on nearby now click on need help sharing click on it and now you should now see help center and all you have to do is click on share and now click and hold the gmail it should take you to the gmail settings scroll down do you see additional settings now click on the three dot on the top right corner then go in for help and feedback now click on help and feedback and now let's search for delete or uninstall apps so just type in delete and it will su suggest in the search list so now let's choose the first one which is the delete or disable and manage apps so now you have it and click on the first one and you are now in the app list so when you are in the app list just scroll to you see settings in the app list scroll to you see settings in the app list and when you do see settings click on it and do open it from there now click on open now uh, in here scroll to you see on let's search for accessibility now here here on search and then type in accessibility and the moment you start typing it will search suggest it for you in the search list and just click on accessibility and in accessibility go to accessibility menu turn on accessibility menu and the moment you do turn on accessibility menu you should now have a green or a green pop-up bottom on the screen so when you do click on it it should show a little menu on your screen so now let's move back to the to the settings main page and search for apps or app now you will see all apps click on it and you click on the app list now scroll to you see Android setup click on it and for stop it just for stop it the moment you first stop it you see your time on top of your notification panel now click the cache and now move back and scroll to you see google play service in the app list now for stop it also and now let's disable it now click on disable and let's disable the app and now we can now move back move back to our startup screen so move back keep on pressing the back key to you are at the startup screen or at the Wi-Fi menu or so in here we have to insert them for us to be able to bypass the Wi-Fi if you do not insert them you will not be able to bypass the Wi-Fi menu no matter what Wi-Fi you do connect so let's insert SIM card and use the SIM to bypass the Wi-Fi menu right over here so let me insert SIM card into the phone
so if you are new to the channel please make sure to subscribe to the channel and also share the video to friends help them unlock their own phone without taking it to repairs so here we have it plug in the sim and the sim should be detected under the wi-fi menu use mobile data to set up your device and click on it and from here after you click on it and from here you can unplug the sim card or just let the sim card be in the phone if you do have data plan on your sim card that's cool you can let the sim card be in the phone since i don't have mobile data i'll have to remove the sim card from the phone and you continue using the wi-fi to set up the device since the sim card is being pulled out of the device the connection to the mobile server will fail so click on ok and click next and continue setting up your device with your wi-fi so let's wait for it so the next step is to click on do not copy data if you have been prompt to copy data or don't copy data just click on don't copy data so just wait so as i said if you are new to the channel make sure to subscribe to the channel and also this tutorial works on all under 12 mtk devices like the infinix device run on android 12 so here we have it click on done copy and wait for the next step which will check for update and then bounce back for update so use this option in here so click on d3 dot here on google uh, assistant keep doing this so you do see the settings available for you to click on it so you keep doing it so here we have it um, let's keep on trying i think i should forward this but i have to make it for you to know exactly what you need to do so just click on the three dots google assistant three dot once again assistant now here on settings oh just do it again just do it again we just have to make sure we are able to click on the settings when google assistant is being prompt us to enable google, uh, google play service so keep doing it so um okay so here we do have it we got we had it so now let's enable google play service enable google play service and i'll go back here on the screen now wait for it to check for update just wait for it and it will skip the google account verification so now accept the terms click accept and now let's set up our device also one important thing that i was unable to show in this video is to do factory reset after successfully unlocking your device so when your device is being fully unlocked make sure to factory reset your device else you will not be able to install apps from unknown source like downloading it from chrome or someone sending you some apps for you to install you will not be able to install apps from outside of play store so make sure to factory reset your device and then set up your device again thanks for watching peace out